VACC's Technical Advisory Service receives many calls requesting information on the operation and diagnosis of shift lock systems. However, of late, one vehicle has formed the majority of these inquiries, the Hyundai iX35. A modern shift lock system prevents the transmission from being moved out of park unless the ignition is on and the brake pedal is depressed. These systems were introduced to reduce the deaths and injuries of vehicles moving unintentionally. So it is very important to diagnose and repair these systems correctly. The iX35 shift lock system uses a solenoid to unlock the shift lever from the park position, which is mounted in the gear shifter assembly in the centre console. Power to the solenoid comes from what Hyundai calls a smart junction box, which is a control unit and fuse box mounted under the driver's side dashboard. Depending on the year and engine type, the PCM, TCM or BCM could control the earth circuit for the shift lock solenoid. Once the control unit receives the signals indicating that the ignition is on, the brake pedal has been depressed, it will provide a path to earth which will actuate the shift lock solenoid. From feedback we have received from VACC Motor Tech subscribers, the following seem to be the three most common issues. Lack of power supply to the solenoid sometimes caused by a blown fuse, a fault in the wiring or connectors, or in some case an internal fault in the smart junction box. Second is an internal fault in the solenoid. You can buy a solenoid separately from the shift assembly. However, you will need to install the wires into the connector correctly as the solenoid has an internal diode. Third, an internal fault in the BCM in later models. If both brake light -like switch signals are being received, you will need to earth the solenoid wire at the BCM connector. If the solenoid actuates, your problem might be in the BCM itself. For more detailed diagnostic steps and wiring diagrams for the iX35 shift lock system, see the July 2022 issue of VACC's Tech Talk magazine. Log on to VACC Motor Tech or call VACC's Tech Advisory Service.